Hey guys, down here your pop culture boy. And for this video, I will be revealing my best songs of the year. Now, I haven't done an end of year list since 2021. That was also the first and last time I made a list. And I didn't make a list for the following years because mainstream music was complete ass, in my opinion. I could have made it like a worse songs list, but it's not fun making videos about things you don't like. Not saying I would never do it, but it's just not fun making videos about things you hate. That aside, for 2024, music has improved in my opinion. Again, this is my best 100 songs of 2024. If you have a problem with this list, make your own in the comments. I'm done. Culture boy. Let's get into it. Now at number 100, we have Biba Dobi, Take a Bite. At number 99, Surf Course Disco. Now this came out in 2019, but it went viral on TikTok this year. The track also impacted the Billboard Hot 100, peaking at number 91. So yeah, it might have came out in 2019, but I definitely feel like this is a song of 2024, seeing that it blew up in 2024. Now at number 98, we have Layla, Not My Problem, 97, Sabrina Carpenter, Juno, 96, Morgan Wallen, Lies, Lies, Lies. At number 95, Coldplay, All My Love, 94, Grace Abrams, I Love You, I'm Sorry, 93, Addison Rae, Aquamarine, 92, Doja Cat, OK Loser, Me and My Boomer Friends Just Love Turning Up To That One. At number 91, Lady Gaga, Happy Mistake. At number 90, Claro, Sexy To Someone. At number 89, Remy Wolf, Cinderella. At number 88, Chloe Bailey, Temporarily Single. At number 87, Casey Musgraves, Irish Goodbye. At number 86, Jake, Clouds. At 85, we have Gigi Perez, Sailor Song. 84, Victoria Justice, Raw. Definitely one of the more surprising releases of this year in terms of enjoyment and the artist. Like, I was just shocked that I enjoyed a Victoria Justice song. It's surprisingly good. At number 83, we have The Weeknd, Timeless, featuring Playboy Cardi. At number 82, I Spice, Think You The Shit, Fart. At 81, Liam Payne, Teardrops. Another track I didn't think I would end up liking, especially from an artist that I, you know, didn't listen to. I'm gonna keep it real. I'm not like a big Liam fan um, or anything like that, but this song really took me back to like a 90s, you know, um, boy band type of vibe. It has like a Savage Garden feel to it just a little bit, but yeah, I do like it. It has, you know, that white swag going on. So yeah, I was pretty shocked that I enjoyed this one, just like the Victoria Justice song. Also, RIP to Liam Payne, because we all know he passed this year. Now at number 80, we have Future, Little Demon. And at number 79, we have Future again, Teflon Don. At number 78, Ariana Grande, The Boy Is Mine. You know, initially, I really enjoyed this one by Ariana Grande, but I think, you know, as time passed, it just got stale pretty quickly. So that's why it's at number 78. At number 77, we have Lou Fei, Goddess. At number 76, we have Camila Cabello with Godspeed. At number 75, Pink Pantheris, Nice to Meet You, featuring Central C. Now I do see some people saying that Central C ruined the song, but to me, I think he added something to the song, and normally I'm not a fan of Central C, but I think this is one of the rare, rare instances where he actually improved the song. Also, shout out to the dancers in the music video. The dance moves were crazy. Now at number 74, David Kushner, Sweet Oblivion. Number 73, Holly Bailey, Because I Love You. Now at number 70, 72, Billie Eilish, Wildflower. Number 71, Flo Millie, Never Lose Me. Number 70, Julie Bailey, Real Bad. 69, Money Long, Ruined Me. At number 68, we have Hallie again, but this time with the track, In Your Hands. Coming in at number 67, Beyonce, Yaya. At number 66, Camila Cabello, Dream Girls. At number 65, Zach Bryan, Pink Skies. I love that song. At number 64, Money Bag Yo, Whiskey Whiskey featuring Morgan Wallen, another banger. At number 63, Tanashi, Nasty. At number 62, Tay McRae, Run for the Hills. Money Long coming in for another entry at number 61 with Make Me Forget. At number 60, Miles Smith, Stargazing. At number 59, Kaigo, Without You featuring Hala.
Now at number 57, we have DJO, pronounced Joe, with the track End Beginning. Now you're probably wondering who is Joe? Well, you know him, he's in Stranger Things. Now he released the track under his stage name, DJO, which is also pronounced Joe, back in 2022, but the song got viral on TikTok in 2024, ended up peaking at number 11 on the Hot 100 this year. Now the track has that blast from the past vibe, very rock synthy 80s track. The lyrics have this call back to like better times, vibe as well. Definitely one of the top songs that I sang in the shower this year. At number 56, we have Tay McRae again, but with this time, it's okay. I'm okay. Now this song, I didn't really like this song um, initially, but I will say it has grown on me. At number 55, we have Childish Gambino, Littlefoot, Bigfoot, featuring Young Nudie. Now this song, I thought got slept on. Bruh, this song is so good, but nobody paid it any attention. Now at number 54, Glorilla, TGIF. At number 53, Megan the Stallion, BOA. Number 52, Kendrick Lamar, Meet the Grams. At number 51, Jack Harlow, Loving on Me. At number 50, Yeet with Breathe. At number 49, Taylor Swift, Fortnite featuring Post Malone. At number 48, Doja Cat, Mask featuring Tizo Touchdown. At number 47, Chaperone, Hot to Go. At number 46, Zane, What I Am. Also, another song that was slept on, and his entire album, by the way, was just slept on and, it, and it's a really good album now at number 45 justin timberlake technicolor at number 44 ariana grande we can't be friends wait for your love at number 43 gonna one of one at number 42 dua lipa illusion number 41 21 savage prove it featuring summer walker number 40 yay featuring ty dollar sign vultures number 39 charlie xcx 360 uh, uh, uh. now at number 38. Nicki Minaj, Cowgirl featuring Lourdes. 37. Ties Music, As Time Flies. Hey! Now, if you want to be transported on a different level, like you're meditating or some shit, this is a song to listen to. As Time Flies by Ties Music. At number 36, Madison Beer, Make You Mine. At number 35, Drake, Push Ups. At number 34, David Kushner, Skin and Bones. At number 33, Justin Timberlake, Selfish. At number 32, Sabrina Carpenter, Bad Cam. Number 31, The Weeknd, Dancing in the Flames. Number 30, Beyonce, Texas. Hold'em. Number 29, 21 Savage and Doja Cat, N-H-I-E. At number 28, Metro Boomin, Kendrick Lamar and Future, Like That. At number 27, we have Claro with Juno. At number 26, Post Malone featuring Blake Shelton, Pour Me a Drink. At number 25, Megan Thee Stallion, Hiss. At number 24, Addison Rae, Diet Pepsi. At number 23, Claro, Nomad. At number 22, Tommy Richmond, Million Dollar Baby. At number 21, Beyonce. Beyonce and Miley Cyrus, Two Most Wanted. At number 20, Sabrina Carpenter, Please Please Please. Number 19, Teddy Swims, The Door. At number 18, Camila Cabello, I Love It, featuring Playboy Cardi. Now I know some of y'all are probably throwing rocks, but hear me out. Camila Cabello was trying to bring back something that was missing from pop music, and I think she did with this song. This song was very much needed in 2024. I think it's artistic. I love it. I don't care what no one says, this is a great song. Number 18, Camila Cabello, I love it featuring Playboy Cardi. At number 17, Sabrina Carpenter, Taste. At number 16, Jade, Angels of My Dreams. Number 15, Post Malone featuring Morgan Wallen, I Had Some Help. At number 14, Billie Eilish, Chihiro. At number 13, Artemis, I Like the Way You Kiss Me. At number 12, Willow, Symptom of Life. At number 11, Chaperone, Good Luck Babe. And at number 10, Shabuzi, A Bar Song, Tipsy. At number 9, Lady Gaga and Bruno Mars with Die With A Smile. At number 8, Hosier, Too Sweet. At number 7, Kanye West, Carnival featuring Ty Dolla Sign. At number 6, Sabrina Carpenter, Espresso. Now it's time for the top 5 songs of 2024. Best songs of 2024. At number 5, Kendrick Lamar, Not Like Us. At number 4, Benson Boone, Beautiful Things. At number 3, Charlie XCX, Von Dutch. At number 2, Beyonce, Bodyguard, and at number one, Billie Eilish, Birds of a Feather. And there you have it, that was my best 100 songs of 2024. Tell me what you think. I'm Daniel Pop Culture Boy, and I will see you in the next one.